Welcome back to Viv Mom Sews, everybody. I'm happy that you're here. Happy Friday. Hope everyone is doing well. I have fabric and patterns to show you. And in fact, I have so many fabrics and patterns to show you that I'm going to have to make this into a one, two, or three part. Two or three part haul video. So let's get going. First, I'll show you the outfit. We've got quick sew pants. Boy, this is a great, great pattern. This is 3807 and they're very close fitting. I used a stretch sateen. So I didn't use an actual knit, but I used a sateen with a little stretch in it. And, ooh, I made notes. It was $3.40 a yard. My top is this popular Project Runway by Simplicity, 8094. And I chose to finish these edges with fold over elastic. I'm gonna have to back up here so that you can see the whole thing. Pants are striped. I call these <laughs> my Brian Jones Rolling Stones pants because I think he wore pants like this back in the 60s. So this tunic is very long. It's got those high splits and it's, it's a great pattern. You know, you just toss it on. So that's what I've got on today. Well, let's get to the good stuff, shall we? I'm gonna show you my cotton jerseys first. And these all came from Mood. They were all, there's one in here that came from Hobby Lobby. The rest came from Mood and they were all $4.99 a yard. The first one, Oh, I've got a description sticker. Fuchsia and teal pashmina paisley cotton jersey. So we've got some paisleys going on. And full on color saturation, which I adore. This is cotton jersey. It's got spandex in it, 5% spandex. Perfectly opaque. Very soft and high quality. Next from Mood, another cotton jersey. This is gray and coral flowers. It's not pink, it's just, it's more of a coral color. But it's a lighter gray and again it the print doesn't continue on the back, but beautiful stretch, totally opaque, soft, lovely. Blue dots, and the little dots are white and blue. On a background of blue, I am not sure what I would do with this but it is one of those beautiful cotton jerseys, 5% spandex, 95% cotton, $4.99 a yard. I don't know, I thought about this as a shirt for my husband, and then I thought it might look goofy. I don't know if a man can wear dots, but um, I could make a dress. Okay, that is all the cotton jersey from Mood. Here I have two cotton jerseys in a nice fall color. I was thinking very basic, maybe turtlenecks or just pullover sweaters. And I took a chance on an outfit off eBay. Now, these are pretty nice. I think I'm 80% pleased, but I can see through them. They're a little spotty, a little bit thin in places. I gotta get over this thin knit fixation or thick knit fixation. Um, the colors are very nice. And these were, 
I believe they were $5.99. I'll write the name of the company down in our description box. Okay, I've got three more, two more pieces from Mood, and they are both woven polyester, and they are absolutely gorgeous. Here is a floral, navy blue background. This is just called woven polyester. It is a little bit sheer. Um, so if I made a dress out of this, I would probably have to line it. And I line almost nothing. So that is something to consider. If I just make like kind of a billowy shirt, I wouldn't put a lining in it. This is a gorgeous crepe de chine. So it is also 100% polyester, but it is called crepe de chine. And it too is slightly sheer, but it is more opaque than the other one. I'm not sure if it goes, I think it goes this way, or you could do it this way. That's kind of like a purple with that seafoam green. Ooh, I love it, love it. Okay, so that's real, you know, pretty and drapey. This is a crepe de chine that came from Fabric Mart. Wild colors, let's just put it that way. What will I do with this? That is a great question because it's got those big panels. So I need to use those to best advantage. Now we're going back to Fabric Mart or were we just there? I, I'm getting so confused with all this fabric. Okay, this is from Fabric Mart. This is a red flannel. Oh, it's so nice. It's very well, not very thin, but rather thin, very red, and I'm going to make my husband a flannel shirt. He likes red, perfect. Uh, what did, oh, here's the sticker. So the price was $4.20 a yard. I like reading those stickers when people show them from Fabric Mart, so I'll show them to you if I can find them. And this is a cotton lawn or voile. It's got lots of paisleys, and I thought this would be a good shirt for my husband as well. That has beautiful fall colors. Where's the sticker? Where's the sticker? Here's the sticker. Okay, what is that called? I'm not sure, but you can see it. And what did I, I paid $5.60 a yard. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to patterns. I have a lot of patterns to show you. Hang on. Oh, hey, there's one more fabric. I didn't get it recently. I got it a while ago. And I saw it on the Fabric Mart website late one night. Note to self, do not shop for fabric late at night. You're going to buy it. I'm talking to myself. You're going to buy a lot. I don't know what it is about late night scrolling, but it's, it's a little dangerous. So I saw this stuff and I thought, wow, that's pretty. I went ahead and ordered, I think I got four yards. It is so beautiful. And I think I have a pattern for it. So hold on, I'm gonna grab it. It's right here. And I've been meaning to show this to you. Look at this, okay. First of all, it's got abstract print so the print changes as you go up and down then it's reversible onto a silver side 
And I don't know if you can tell how luxurious it is. It shines, it's heavy, and yet very fluid. It's not stiff at all. I love, oh my gosh, I love this fabric. This would qualify as like a precious fabric to me. And I must use it to its absolute fullest potential. So how do I do that? Well, here's my idea. Vogue 8968. And what I would do, see, the dress of course is split in half there with that seam. So I could have like black, the black for the top or the silver for the top and then the black for the bottom. And now I'm thinking maybe I should wear this <laughs> to the wedding party. Oh no, I'm not usually an indecisive person, but this stuff is so glorious and it's been waiting so patiently. So that's just something I wanted to share with you. I'll see, I'm a little tired of sewing with slinky, slippery fabric for the, uh, for the party dresses, but this one might be a contender. You know what I'm saying? Okay, here come the patterns. We'll start with my new look patterns today, and I'm a big new look fan, but here's the thing. I am sewing a new look jacket right now, and there are already two errors in the pattern, and I made sure they're not my errors, they're, they're new looks errors. So, you know, it happens, but I still like them. So let's get started. We have 6588. This will be for my husband, my hubby, and I love that hood. It has pockets, it looks warm, it's got a zipper in the one he's wearing, little zip up front. And I thought, yeah, that's really nice. So you know I had to go order fabric for it, and that's on the way, so you'll be seeing that. New look, 6573, can you beat this? We've got a column dress, and we've got this giant dramatic poncho. This does not come with the hat. I absolutely love the lines of that dress. Simple lines, style lines that are so flattering. Um, another thing I wanna point out, here you see the poncho, and here it is on her. So it's a lot longer than it looks in the little drawing. New look, 6575. I love it. I don't know if it's exactly my style or if a busty gal can get away with this, but I'm gonna try because Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Okay, six, five, eight, one. Look at that little wrap dress. And they put it over pants. I love it, I love it. So I gotta make the outfit that she is strutting along in. Um, and maybe I'll do, maybe I'll do a tunic. Oh my gosh, I love them all. This is for knits and I had to order um, new knits for that, so I'll be showing you that. New look, 6585. Look at that coat. It is not lined, so um, I'm not skilled enough to just pop in a lining. Although maybe I could look it up and see how it's done. I kind of wish it were lined because it'd make it warmer. However, adorable. It's got pockets, it's got a hood, and really great choices on there to choose from. They suggest double-faced or reversible fabrics with double face only. Can you tell I don't have my glasses on? 
double faced or reversible fabrics only. And they say the wrong side of fabric will show. New Look 6585, I will list all of these patterns in the description box. New Look 6602, basic. You know what this is to me? This is Eileen Fisher right here because fabric is everything. So a kind of futuristic or industrial stretch suiting in a somber color, you've got Eileen Fisher right there. And I'm gonna make it. New look, 6602. New look, 6233. Now see these price tags on there where it says Hobby Lobby, 659. That's not what they sell for there. They, the new looks sell for $3.95 there but they ring up $6.59. So you really have to catch it and, and let the cashier know. Anyway, it's kind of ridiculous, but here is New Look 6233. The reason I bought this pattern is for this shirt right here for men. I love yokes. And who can't use a great warm fuzzy shirt for winter? Plus there's other stuff in there, really cute stuff. All right, new look, 6420. A lot of you may already have this pattern. Um, it's not new, it's not that remarkable, but the pants have that little pleat line crease. Yeah, they have a crease sewn right into them and they're straight and slim fitting, and I love them. Do they have pockets? I can't see. Um, and you know, there's no descriptions on new look or simplicity. They don't describe the garments. They just say, misses five sizes in one. Well, that is not much of a description to me, but at any rate, I love those pants will be making them. New Look 6298, this is a popular one on pattern review. I've seen people um, sew this one up and not award it five stars. I think I've seen a couple four stars. So I'm not sure what that means if there's something funky in there. Hinky. <laughs> something cattywampus. I don't know, but it, you know, I'm hoping it'll go well. Now, these last ones, I found these in the, um, in the drawer at Walmart. And I was like, get out. These are great. Where'd these come from? So simple. 8683. You'll have to look at the line drawing for this one. And this dress, I know I have it in another pattern. So why did I buy it? Well, first of all, it was 97 cents. It's really, really cute. And I can just work out any fit issues with this one. And then I have two of them. So I thought that was so attractive. All right, it's so easy. Eight, six, seven, seven. So simple. I probably would not wear a cami like this out of my house just because it's a lot of skin and I'm kind of up there in years. But this is so cute because I love front seams. I love front seams. Um, and that has one, right? Yes, it does. It has one. It's a cute little kind of like an A shape and I thought, gosh, that'd be really cute. I could wear it out of the house with a kimono or a cardigan over it. And then, so simple, 1048, a very straightforward, um, like a palazzo pant, 
no pockets. Shoot, I'd like to add pockets. I think it's for wovens, and that's what I'll choose for that. We're done for today. <laughs> We're done for today. It's a little long. I always want to make my videos shorter because, oh, I don't know. Um, thank you all for your replies, comments, responses to party dresses. I love reading what you think. You have great observations and choosing a dress for this affair is not gonna be that easy. So I love getting help from you. I hope you have a wonderful weekend and I'm going to be back next week with part two, I'll call this part one, with part two of more fabric, more patterns. I'll see you then. Bye.